How's it going guys? Uh, today I want to do a little video on the uh, cleanup and the uh, heat sinks. Uh, just take this little lever here on the top of this, the Model 1, and just flip it forward. You'll have to take your finger and or a screwdriver and pry that up. Then the heat sink will just lift away. Now I've already cleaned these. Um, with this one, same thing, you just push down on it, that side will pop up. You'll want to disconnect your fan if it isn't already disconnected. It'll be uh, hooked right there. And then just set your heat, heat sinks out of the way. And then now you have your. device is cleaned off already. Um, I've used alcohol and uh, some uh, Q-tips. Uh, after I, I had to use uh, heat to get the uh, it's like a silicone based uh, compound that they had on these. Uh, really really sticky. It uh, won't really come off with uh, just alcohol. Uh, I purchased some um, silicone-based uh, heat sink compound from Radio Shack, and um, what you do is just take your tube, apply a little to uh, the top of each one, and um, of course I use my trusty Xbox cart. Um, you'll apply some on there, and just smear it where it's nice and flat you don't want to glob it on there and put a big old glob where it just pours out the side it just needs just a little skim coat across both of the tops of these and uh, then you'll just attach your uh, heat sinks back on uh, for the uh, board and my previous video I was showing the uh, bad capacitors as you can see, the, uh, the board isn't eating away. Uh, I was concerned about the traces because it, uh, it was a pretty uh, considerable amount of leakage going on there. And, uh, as you can see, the, uh, I just took some alcohol and cleaned up the, uh, the area that was affected by the leakage. It leaked all the way over here and down on the bottom of the uh, motherboard. Uh, this is where the other two um, capacitors were. Uh, this one was leaking pretty bad too. Uh, I went ahead and pulled this one and uh, cleaned up the area. Uh, all the excess flux uh, that I used to remove them also board over and um, as you can see uh, it's nice and clean and no trace damage and um, what I'll be doing is uh, installing new capacitors um, even a new clock capacitor uh, you can pick these up at Radio Shack uh, this for the clock the for the clock capacitor it was a uh, 272-1028 and that's a 100 UF electro electrolyte capacitor um, so the other two were um, uh, 22 UF uh, their part number was 272-1028 I'll leave a, um, a link in the description and I, I needed a couple of them I went ahead and picked me up a um, spare one for uh, my other Xbox but that's where I'm at guys and uh, I'm gonna jump on this and uh, see where we're at uh, with replacing these to uh, 
see if that eliminated my fragging problem which I'm uh, pretty sure it, it was the problem because it was a pretty pretty considerable amount of damage well guys hope you enjoyed it peace out from Texas